this is Star Wars The Black Series 6 inch Finn in his first order disguise action figure review. Finn is part of Wave 13 in the Black Series line. And he is the very first Finn figure that I have ever purchased. Now, I'll admit right away that Finn is not my favorite character in Star Wars at all. I don't really see the point of his character or Rose um, in the latest trilogy of Disney's Star Wars. But nonetheless, when I picked this guy up off Amazon, he was on sale for about $13 back around Christmas time. So, here he is. The packaging is your standard Black Series packaging. Very cool looking illustration here of Finn, John Boyega, in his first order disguise. He is number 51 in the line. And let's take a look at the back here. To carry out a mission crucial to the Resistance film, Finn adopts a first order officer's uniform, yada yada yada. And we all know what happens next if you've seen the movie. The Last Jedi. Now they did release the deleted scenes from The Last Jedi DVD which was just released uh, this week. And they cut out a really cool scene of Finn um, and Captain Phasma in a duel. I have no idea why they cut this, uh, cut this scene out. Um, if you haven't seen it, I will include a link in the video description below for you to check it out. But man, it was such a shame and, and that they didn't include that in the actual movie. I think, I think, um, Ryan Johnson really, really, really missed the ball on that one. But, anyways, here is Finn. Um, again, a very basic looking figure. Um, first order uniform with... A head that's probably been reused a couple of times by Hasbro. If you've noticed, his first order disguise hat is removable, which is a nice touch. It fits on fits on Finn really, really well. Didn't expect that, to be honest with you. But, you know, a good touch by Hasbro. The head, I'm pretty sure, is recycled parts. Um... Uh, Possibly the same fin head um, that they used in for the Force Awakens figure. Now I wouldn't be able to compare right now in this video because I don't have one. Um, again, this is the very first fin figure that I've picked up in the Black Series line. But here he is in all his glory. The coolest part about this set is this little accessory that comes included um, this is the little this is the little weapon uh, I'm not sure what it's called but this is the weapon that Finn uses to attack Phasma in the movie now you can actually pull down the little parts here so it's not ignited but you can also pull it back up so that it is ignited as you see just as you see in the film. So, really cool accessory. Finn holds it pretty well. Um, I guess that's how you hold it? I'm not even sure. Is that how he holds it in the movie, guys? I don't know. But he holds it pretty well, and that's the point. enough of that he can't actually hold this baton with both of his hands unfortunately which I thought was a real bummer um, you know in the film if I recall correctly he just swipes at Phasma with one hand but it would have been really nice if he would be able to actually um, hold it with both of his um, arms, both of his hands, but sadly that's not the case. But there's that.
He also comes with a highly detailed um, blaster, which is nice. It fits relatively well in his hands, um, as I'll quickly show you right here. He does have trigger fingers, which I was hoping, yep, he does have trigger fingers, which should help with the grip of the blaster. There we go. So he holds it pretty well. Let's put it back in here. He does come with a holster as well and the gun fits all right. I mean, I wouldn't say that's like a snug fit by any stretch of our imagination, but it does his job. Articulation wise, he is your standard Black Series figure with standard Black Series articulation, full rotation on the head, it moves up and down, ball jointed torso, elbows, jointed elbows, swivel wrists, we got a ball hinged hip. No swivel, swivel, swivel thighs, double jointed knees, and ankle rockers. So, pretty basic Black Series figure. Now, would I recommend picking this one up? I, I'm not sure. I mean, if you're a fan of the character itself, and you really like Finn, I guess it's a nice addition to your Black Series collection. Um, if you need a couple of Stormtrooper, uh, not Stormtrooper, First Order officers um, on your shelf, I mean, Finn would definitely fit the bill when you put his hat on. Um, alongside Kylo Ren and Snoke and Hux. Or if you really want to pose Finn with Captain Phasma, you can do it as well. But otherwise, if you can find him on clearance or if you can find him um, for sale, I would definitely just wait and hold. Um, I would not pay full price for this guy. Again, he's a very, very... Generic looking character, reused reused head sculpt. Um, maybe I'm just a little biased here since I don't really like the character a whole lot, but you know. If you want to pick him up, he should be available right now in the US, actually on clearance. Um, but he shouldn't be too hard of a character to find. So that was Finn, First Order Disguise in the Black Series line action figure review. If you like this video, please make sure to give it a like and hit the subscribe button for more great content to come. And until the next time, may the toys be with you.